What's up guys? Welcome back to another Red Dead Redemption 2 episode. Right now we're in Rhodes. We're gonna go check out the lead for that moonshine stranger we saw in the last episode and keep causing some chaos. Chaos is our commitment. Glad you dropped in. I've got that uh information you asked for. You huh? Info. Um, need something more specific this time. A wagon full of moonshine. Well, you might just be in luck. Cool. I knew I picked the right feather to speak to. Boy, you got killed in the roads. Whoop. Don't want to do that. I can't pay off my bounty anyways. Whatever. Well, cool. Praise be. Bridge in Blue Water Marsh, north of St. Denis. Look for a wagon coming south. Should be carrying a load of moonshine bottles in the back. Drive careful with it X. Thanks, dude. Is that going to be on our map now or what? Yeah, it's it up there. Kind of a hike. Yeah. Um, You might just go tackle that when we're next to it, you know? Mm-hmm. How do you do, sir? So, at least that's on our map now. So, when we're back over, like, north of St. Denis, we can go do that. But there's a stranger right here. Let's check him out, and then we'll go back to camp and see what's going down. Cool. To down, to down, down. It's so funny, like when you move like places in this game. It's like you're going back through like old territory. Like we used to just be in roads for so long. Now we're like never here anymore. Mm -hmm. And when I'm back, I'm like, oh yeah, I remember this place. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a cool spot. It's a cool game. What am I talking about? What's going on here? Uh oh. What you fools up to? Is Mr. Black's fault? His fault to Darky White. Well, I don't know why they call <laughs> what? that. Look at him. Don't you start now. I'll knock the color clean off you. Come on. And I'll tell you, you lily livid. Enough. Huh. You two fools look like you've just run off a chain gang. Yeah, what of it? What are you doing? Starving. They got bounty posters for us all over town. And we can't go into town to get supplies. Say, mister, maybe you can do us fools a favor. We ain't bad guys at all. He's okay. Even for a darkie. Shut it, you pasty face streak of piss. Yeah, I had up to here with you. No. What a classic do team. Goddamn huh? favor, what you want? Maybe you can go into town and take down them wanted posters of us. Okay. Maybe meet us back at the campfire in the woods and tell us how you did. Uh, maybe bring us a little bite to eat. Don't push your luck. Nice fella. Yeah, you love nice fellas. Don't you start up again. <laughs> we love nice fellas. Shut up. <laughs> you gotta get out of here. Are they like visible to me or what? Like, am I just gonna have to find them? I'm saying the sheriff's office. If there's one. Somewhere where they normally hang them. Hang. Well, didn't we kill the sheriff? Dog, 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 say hi to the dog. Pat. Pat. Hi. You wanna be our friend? Will you be my pet dog? Oh, that was a cute popper. Good popper boy. Is he following us? I don't think so. Oh no, that's a horse. Look at that. Why is that other horse following me? I don't know. I don't know either. Where? Get a move on, will you? It's a goddamn war. You said it. Hello, Hello mister. <laughs> hey! Hey, it's good to see you again. Hey, crazy old fool. But, uh, what you doing here? Just visiting old friends, I guess. Well, you better get out of here. There's a, there's a bunch of government agents I met asking about you all across town. Yeah, them and a bunch of bounty hunters, too, I think. Uh, so. Yeah. Uh oh. Pinkerton. You don't seem too scared. 
Guess not. Well, they seem pretty mad. <laughs> What'd you do? Nothing good. <laughs> well, <laughs> you better get out of here. <laughs> I kidnapped the president's daughter. Yeah, be careful, Carol. I ain't as bad as you made Hello, out there. Sir. Bad, they worse than worse. Yo, it's us one for gossip. Jeff Joe Mingle thought. Here we go, here's one. Cool. But as usual, you're spreading lies. Lies? Every fool knows the charges were trumped up. Okay, cool, it tells us. That there's five of them. I wonder if they're like designated spots like I don't know hands wanted hands wanted I just come hands wanted I think I just come through with like a bucket full of hands <laughs> they're like well they were wanted <laughs> that was good this is a good one right that was a good one I said they're probably like in the town. Yeah, I was thinking maybe there was one over there on the outskirts. Dude, this other horse is just following me around. Cool. Oh, there's one right there. I guess when I'm close by, it kind of lets me know. That's helpful. Yeah. I like that. Because if I was just looking for these willy nilly, I feel like it would be pretty difficult. Did it say on there what, um, what they're wanted for? Maybe. I didn't look. I'll check on the next, next one. one. Yeah. Here's one. What we got in the post over here? Oh, I guess I need to get this guy out of here. Hey, move. I need that poster. Oh, I'll move, all right. How's this for moving? You ain't the law, you know. Kill that bastard. All right, dude. No damn manners. Yeah, right. Get out of here, bro. Day. This what you wanted? That guy's gone. Man. Whoa! You're in trouble. You want more? Bounty hunting bastard. Come on, buddy. I'll knock your head. Get out of here. Yeah, right? Which one's my hat? This uh, one? No, the other one. That one. This one? Yeah. Nope. Yeah, it is. You're the tall hat. Oh, yeah, you're right. I know. I know. That's what you get for messing with me, dude. Yeah, right? You mess with the bull, you get the horns, my friend. They just want it because they escaped, I guess. Huh. Okay. It's three down. Probably one right by the train station, I would imagine. Yeah. Yeah. Ah! Move out of the darn way. <laughs> so weird. Jerk. Maybe in here. Be careful where you're going. There it is right there. Hello there. Evening. One more. Nothing like a little good house cleaning, right? House cleaning. Come on, Dr. G. I guess I might have rode it like rode it once in the past or something because it's following me around like we're best friends really dr. gizmo is my best friend take that horse it's like I trusted you
There's a lot of stuff going on in roads right now. He's gonna fight you. Well, he just made a mistake. attracted some attention okay saved a woman's life that's pretty nice of me cool. maybe there's one over here nope oh, there it is There's been a recall. I weren't born yesterday. This one's mine, so you can go and get your own. Out of the way! Come on, Dr. Giz. You gotta chase this guy down and shoot him. Clear with you, mister. Yep, yep. Aww. <laughs> oh, I wish a fence impaled you. What was that about? <laughs> okay, girl. It just flew. Oh, you hit that stick. I guess you're right. I wish the. I really do wish the fence impaled you, though. Hey, Mark, hold up. Whoa. Oh, wrong guy. To it, then, I guess. Oh, you're right. It's the wrong guy. I'm gonna have to kill both these guys. Fall off your horse already. Did he fall? Yep. Where is he? Oh, Got him right here. Cool, I thought. Oh, run. Yep. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Whatever. Rick. I'm out of the, out of here, anyways. Yeah, yeah. Whatever. I ain't afraid to use. What's the matter to use? So where's these guys supposed to be? I think right here. It looks like it's locked. Yeah, it's because I'm, like, investigated right now. Doodly doo, doodly doo, under the tutelage, Randy tutelage. I kind of feel bad for that little other spotted horse that was following you around. He fell in love with you. They all fall in love with me. Yeah. I wonder why it's locked right now. Maybe it's not late enough? Oh, to my yeah. recent crimes, are you kidding me? I'm gonna go pay off my bounty. Oh, okay. I just had to move in and out, I guess. Sometimes it makes you do that, it's weird. Oh, <laughs> the fire just Whoa. appears back. Well, there's a red guy over there. Yeah, it's like a cop looking for me. Hey, friend. Hello. 
I was in town. Pretty hot. There's quite a price on you boys. <laughs> it is so unfair. I, I didn't do nothing. Well, they said you was wanted for murder. It was a murder. It was self-defense. And you killed a farmer? Well, firstly, I would have, but he died before I could. And secondly, well, he had it coming. He... I don't like to say. Well... Ain't no business of mine. Here's the posters. Thanks, partner. Yeah, yeah. That's that, then. That's that. Free at last. Free from you, at least. Well, not quite. No? We should wait a while first, see if anyone's on our trail. You're right. Too risky to split up now. Two sets of eyes is better than one. This ain't permanent, though. It's a temporary measure. Well, right, right. Till things blow over. Just kill these guys right now. <laughs> I'll let them live. Let those boys live. Yeah, right. Maybe you'll run into them in the future and they'll give you things. That's what I was thinking. You know, might as well just let them live. It'd be kind of pointless to just do that for them and kill them. Oh, you didn't bring them food, yeah. though. I could have. I have plenty of food. We didn't give them any. That wasn't an option. Oh, true. But now we're oh, on the road God. again. Just can't wait to be on the road again. Oh, we haven't been back to camp in so long. I'm excited. When it was going down or up or in the upside down, you know what I mean? Yeah, right. Do you know what I mean? You know what I mean, Jelly Bean? Jelly Bean Jean. Jelly Bean Steve. Yeah, right. They're all part of the Jelly Bean clan. And my plan. Yeah, my plan is by the end of the year to be part of the Jelly Bean clan. Frick yeah. They have a real rough negotiation, initiation process. I agree. You can't really get away from them. Like a gang hideout right here. Cool. Oh, would they see you? Maybe. Definitely want that new shotgun I got. Heck yeah. And my old faithful. There we go. Goodbye to your head. Yep. Yeah, we're gonna be there. There's gonna be so much stuff here. Oh, hide behind that tree. Yeah, we're doing mounts then. Yep. Whoa! Hide behind the tree first next time. Dang, man. That was quick. Oh, let me go back to that. Yeah, right? Bow, bow, wow, 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 Where you at? Um, was this it right here, you think? I don't know, does it right, it doesn't it draw the places you died? Nah. Kind of looks like it, though. Maybe, right? I don't know if I was that far from town, though. I have no idea. I'm just going to go this real quick and See what check it out. Check, 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 check it out. Try to be sneaky this time. Yep. I don't think this is actually it, but we'll see. It looks like it for sure. Yeah, totally. That's it. We're going way too fast. Take up any you can find and hold. 
That shotgun just blows people up. For sure. It's a good end. Senseless idiots. I don't even know who those guys were. Like, did it say anything in specific? Specific? No. Yeah, whatever. There's nothing to take? I think so. Here, you go down and try to break that box. Where? Over to the left. Yeah, over by the fire. Box, shoot it. Just Make like a sure. place I can cook and stuff. I didn't kill these guys, I promise. Oh, they're one raiders. <laughs> Did you see that? Mm hmm His head was completely taken off. <laughs> oh, stop Just for it. good measure. Just for good pleasure. That's what it's all about in the end. Only four dollars? Yeah. Those are my bullets. Oh. I'd say you got a lot more money than that. What did you spend? It? Yeah, right. Those two chain gang guys like totally just swindled me. Well, it's a good thing you killed those guys because they were right next to you guys. Yeah. They For sure. Been trying to like, they could have been like bounty hunters or something, or trying to rob you. Could have been, should have been, would have been day. Oh, 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 oh. Stuck. <laughs> Trust the old box. What, you can't run in your camp? Nah, I just let you go super slow. Why? How you doing, Mr. I don't know. Taylor? How are you? Been quite a journey since I, well, since I joined you fellas. Yes. And now you and Dutch have joined high society. My lord above. Yeah, it seems so. I think my days in polite society are over. Well, I just saw Bill Williamson at a party at the <laughs> San Denise's mayor's house. <laughs> if he can do it, anyone can. You get any leads? Yeah, I think so. You know so, Arthur Morgan. Come on, we need to talk. Miss Sadler, will you excuse us? When are you gonna let me come robbing with you, Dutch? My lord, a few more like her, we could take over the whole world. <laughs> Hmm. You more like her, there wouldn't be much of a world. Left. I feel like she's gonna yes, become Arthur's perhaps. like lady. Yeah, yeah, maybe. The trolley bus station. I went down there. I took a look at it. I think we can hit it. <laughs> I ain't never robbed in a city before. Yeah, well, you leave the plan in to me. She'll ride with me. Always. Is it just you and me? No, we'll need one more, I reckon. I say Lenny. Not Micah. Well, that depends. No, Micah's on insane. Yeah. Later. No, I wish that there was something I could do to make the two of you get along better. Well, that's easy. Kill him. Make him change. Very funny. Not what Micah. Why would we want Micah, stupid? He loves Micah. Who's dead? Aww. Who's that? What have they done to me? Look, they're in the tree line. That was the guy who was with um, the O'Driscolls who we saved and became part of our gang. Oh my gosh. Good thing I have my bold action rifle. Mm. Wish I had some like explosives on me. It'd be perfect right now. Yeah. 
Dude, did you see what they did to that guy? Yeah. It was crazy. That's disgusting. They like cut his eyes out and chopped his head off. I'm gonna get down there. What about you, Dutch? Yeah, right. I want to cover that, no? I guess you're going through the window? I have no idea. It kind of is like... Here, you go. No, they're on the other side of the... Oh, yeah, over door. there. Go, go, go. They got in? No, we got to retreat back. That's what it said. Why doesn't anybody else want to come inside? Let's go. I don't think they want to go inside. Get those doors down and quick. Good. Now, everyone I got this. Get these windows covered quickly. John, you take the windows over there. Charles, you take the side door. There. Arthur, you take the windows in the back. Go. Shit, dude. Oh my gosh, this is so hey, nerve raging. I said it's everyone accounted for. I don't know. I think. I don't know. I guarantee a couple more people died, right? Come on. Yeah, I'd say somebody else died. I bet, you, you know what? I bet that kid, like, ends up being in trouble again. I know, like, he ends up being okay, but, like, because he's in the first game. Yeah. You know what I mean? Look at these guys. They're, like, wearing bags over their head. Or maybe his mom or something. Sadie? Yeah, that chick we were just talking to. Oh, goodness. She's probably totally fine fighting people off by herself. Yeah, I got him pretty good. Uh oh. Are there are dress goals. Yeah. Did I miss all this? Come on, Arthur. Now we go back. We need you in the house, Mrs. Sandler. She ain't messing around. Cool. Neither am I, though. Man, there's so many of them coming. How can the O'Driscolls beat us? There's like a thousand of them. There's like, what, 15 of us, maybe? That's better. Plus, we got Adler. I know it was a Charles. I thought it was a bad guy for a second. They're running? Looks like it. Yeah, but if they run away, they'll come back. There's more people. Don't worry, they ain't getting away from me. Two more. It's over. Oh, 
Oh, still on me shoot though. It's kind of been like a. They went to like widescreen, like yeah. it's going into a cutscene. Dutch is pissed. I think so. Except for Karen here. Uh, poor kid. Mr. Swanson, could you take this boy and bury him someplace near, but not too near? Of course. Charles, help me with the body. We need to get this place cleaned up. Mr. Pearson, Miss Grimshaw. Already taking care of it. Come oh my on gosh, now. I can't Work. believe they did that to that guy. Como Driscoll. That man. Really hate. So can I, Arthur. So can I. We need to get moving. Away from here. So we should start looking for another camp. You ain't thinking big enough, Arthur. You ain't seeing the vastness of our problems and our opportunities. I'm oh, not boy. sure I get you. You will, son. You will. Meet me near the trolley station. We got work. Shall we? Yep. <laughs> Look at that hat's flashing like I could pick it up. That's because it's your hat. Oh, was it? Yeah. He saved my life. I could not save his. Mrs. Adler fought braver than any of us. She is driven by powerful forces I scarcely understand. That's what love has done to her, I guess. Cool. Well, we won't be much safer here for long. Yeah. Which stinks too, cause like, you have a bad. Right? You weren't there for very long either. No, nah, we haven't been at this campsite long at all. But I do feel like... I don't know. I feel like... Um, you didn't go very far this time. I feel like the first time you moved, you went further than this time. Yeah. Arthur, I can't believe those pigs did that to him. You can. He was such a gentle soul. Yeah, he saved my life one time. I'll miss him. You make the bastards pay, Arthur. If we get the chance, we surely shall. We're getting the chance. Yeah, right? Maybe not immediately, but we are. Easy, killer. That's rich from you. I don't want to clean all that blood off yourself. Yeah, right? Cool. Yep. Oh my gosh. Whoa, dead horse. Dead horse. Where are you trying to go? Back to St. Denise. To the trolley station? Uh, I think we're going to check out some other really quick yeah. thing. Oh, well, before you do that, cool. Yeah. Cute. Head to the swamp, 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 swamp. Get a little bath for Doctor Gizmo. Haha! <laughs> there you go, Giz. Ooh. <laughs> that looked like a bush to me. I didn't know. <laughs> I didn't know. I swear. You've been running into so much stuff today. I, feel I like. have been. <laughs> oh, those gators! Oh goodness, not the gators. Some gators. Some gators. Not them gators again. <laughs> Those must be the white bands. <laughs> what was that, turtle? Oh, that's so cool. Are you going to kill the turtle? Of course. Why? Because it seems like the only thing I should do. But it's a turtle. Track. Ha <laughs> <laughs> That's a big turtle, man. Give me that turtle that meat. That just made me too sad. Poor turtle boy. You just took its heart. <laughs> I took something.
I increased my dead eye by killing that turtle, so totally worth it. Totally. Look at this thing. It's an alligator snapping turtle. That thing is scary looking. Yeah, right? Cool. No way that would ever just stay on my horse, you know? I know. All these animals, I feel like, wouldn't. Yep. Especially this thing, though. Look at it. Oh, I wish I could just keep that in the back of my horse forever. It looks so cool. <laughs> Maybe you can keep the shell. Maybe. Look at uh, these guys. Hello, boy. This is a good place to fish. Apparently. I think I jumped this. Nice. Cool. Uh, nice. Nice. Yep. Turn, just start coming. You're right, but it also is the quickest way. Life hacks. <laughs> Nothing like riding the train tracks on a horse. Just ask Cornwall. Freaking Cornwall. I can't believe that just. Uh, or the address goes just did that. Yeah, that was. A I feel like in this game, like, when any crazy stuff like that happens, it's always, like, at the least expected time and moment. I agree. You're just kind of like, oh, we're just going to go do a random thing. And then it's like, oh, wait, we're actually just going to get ambushed completely. Sorry, blind guy. Yeah, right? Go get some eyes. <laughs> Stranger. Stranger. Excuse me. Hey, do I know you? Mr. I believe we've met. We have. At that ghastly party. Oh, Evelyn Miller. Unfortunately so, Mr. Arthur Morgan, at least sometimes. <laughs> Can I say something rude? Sure. The mayor thinks you robbed him. Oh, I, oh, to be clear, he... <laughs> He wasn't very upset about it. He rather liked you. Okay. Do you, uh, well, I mean to say, uh, can you steal things? Is there a reason you're asking me to incriminate myself, Mr. <laughs> Miller? <laughs> this guy is, like, very well, shady so about it. Have you met? Uh, this is Rain's Fall, the great chief, and his son, Eagle Flies. Gentlemen, yeah, we saw you in the wagon train crossing the river at Cumberland Falls. And at the party, you were upstairs. Well, you have great powers of observation. As my people, if we are even a people anymore, we've fought hard. We've made peace treaties, and those treaties were broken. And we've been moved and punished and punished and moved. I'm sure. And now I am told we are to be moved again. Clearly contravening the peace treaty signed three years ago. This will lead to war. No, my son, it will not. We cannot fight another war. They have got stronger, and we have become far weaker, Mr. Morgan. Well, it's a bad business. It's to do with oil. I know it is, but I need the proof. I believe there were some prospectors who were on their land a few months ago who have filed reports with Leviticus Cornwall and the state government claiming huge reserves of oil under their land. It's always about oil. <laughs> you want me to try and steal it? Obviously they can't. <laughs> and even more obviously, I would be useless. <clears throat> Listen, I realize that it is a ridiculous request, but we're very desperate. Now, I'm not a do-gooder, Mr. Miller. Gentlemen, I'm very sorry for your predicament, but... I'm a working man. I got problems of my own. We will pay you very handsomely, Mr. Morgan. How much? I told you, they're all mercenaries. <laughs> <laughs> There's a price on my head in two states, my friend. The government doesn't like me any more than it does you. Like you, I've been running for as long as I can remember. And like you, my time here is nigh undone. We understand, and we will pay. Thank you. You meet my son in a couple of days near 
Citadel Rock, just west of the oil fields. Okay. We are very grateful for your help. Gentlemen, that cool. appointment with the His Senate. son looks like some kind of guy that would be there. like, so wanted so to time. come over to the cowboy life, you know what I mean? Yeah. We must try everything. Just like, join your clan? Yeah. Hello, Mr. Miller. The counselor wants to apologize. He can see you now. We've been waiting, I don't know how long. Or next month, if you'd like to reschedule. Come. Perhaps the senator won't mind waiting. Yeah. Eagle fly. You should go sell that turtle. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do right now, actually. Is this him right here? What? That guy. That buys turtles? Nah. That, those Native American guys are just about. Oh, okay, cool. I guess it hasn't popped up yet because. It said a couple days. It said a couple of days. A couple of days. Oh, let's go to the butcherman. Cool. Butcherman Brown. Just gonna call every butcher Butcherman Brown. In Butchertown. And just wait for one of them to actually be named Brown. He's like, You know me? He's like, I don't know you. I don't know you, my friend. God, that I, for so, I don't know what it was about that scene in particular, but like, hey, just like the shots on Arthur's face and like his expression and like yeah. the lighting, just thought it was all really good. I was like, just like this is awesome. I agree. So good, like just the the voice acting and like in these Rockstar games, like more than like I think a lot of games, even though a lot, a lot of games are getting to that point now. But it's not just like voice acting. Like the people are actually like, it's like a real role. Yeah. There's like, I think the guy who played Arthur was like doing work for like four or five years on this game. Huh. Like just recording stuff and like getting direction and all kinds of stuff. Is that not him or what? Hello. Fine morning. I guess he's over here. <laughs> Oh, that guy, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that was good. 45 cents for the turtle? Come on. That's it? Seemed like it should have been better. I agree. Seems like the beat should always be better. You know what I mean? Yeah. I always forget to eat, but like, you know, eat up, get healthy, get healthy nice and, and strong. strong. You always gotta get strong. You always gotta get strong. Always gotta get strong. Let me see. Let me know if you see any of the hair tonic. It's like a white bottle. Here it is. That beard is getting so long. So long. Excuse yourself, lady. Because it's time for next time on Space Horse. Space Horse. Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, next time, we'll see if we can get those nasty O'Driscolls back. And see what other chaos we can get into. We got to get take down those scoundrels. Adios. Adios. Adios.